Hello, I am Dr. Nagaraj Puttaswamy. I am a laparoscopic and a bariatric surgeon at Punya Hospitals, Bangalore. Okay, a child having appendicitis. Appendicitis is a infective condition wherein uh, if it is a child over about 8, 10 years or 15 years, uh, the child will usually present with uh, pain abdomen, vomiting and fever. These are called as cardinal symptoms of appendicitis. Usually the child will have uh, pain abdomen in the epigastric, that is in the upper abdomen to start with. Gradually it will descend to the umbilical region and finally settle in the right lower part of the abdomen that is called as the right iliac fossa. The pain uh, migrates from the epigastric to the right iliac fossa and uh, parallelly uh, just because the inflammation is significant uh, pain will be intense and the child will be throwing that is vomiting repeatedly even if uh, the child consumes water, juice or even a soft diet. But if the intensity of the infection or inflammation continues to be there and if it is not addressed very urgently the pain will uh, go on to a present in the form of fever and by the time uh, the child presents to a doctor usually the symptom starts in the morning and the child comes to the doctor to uh, say around in the afternoon or in the evening and the diagnosis will happen immediately only on clinical examination that there will be tenderness that is pain elicited on examination and there will be a condition called rebound tenderness. An examination finger which will be taken out urgently will elicit significant amount of pain. That is a typical feature of any sort of localized peritonitis in that area. That says that the child suffers from appendicitis. Definitely, see, it's not to be you know, understood and planned by a parent or a guardian, but usually a clinician does it much better.